guys, it's Karen from Artifall Acrylics. Welcome to the show. Uh, today I'm doing just a little commission piece for Fiona um, from Fiona's Art. We all know and love her. If you're not familiar, please check out her channel. I'll put a link up above. Um, she requested uh, two 8x8s in the same colors that I used for the demo when I was uh, showing how to puff with the Australian and American flow trawl. So I'm just gonna make her a couple little paintings. Yeah, let's get started. All right, so I'm just starting this from this point forward because I already had a fail. And uh, why make you suffer through it for six minutes? Um, I'm gonna try this again. I um, didn't like the order I had. I had uh, green, gold, no, I had uh, blue, gold, green, with the black cell activator and it just looked too dark. So I'm gonna do it again. Uh, order kind of matters sometimes for blooms and I'm gonna put the gold on top. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna put blue down first. Or this is, you know, their version of Payne's Gray. And then the olive line next and then some iridescent gold by golden lots of gold so i just really like the gold and i'm going to use uh the artist loft professional series carbon black as my cell activator with uh, a strolling flow draw and this is a four to one ratio and just blow this out real quick before it runs away. So uh, cool air, I have my big guy out, but cool air, medium fan, medium fan, sorry. People had recommended using shower caps um, for my spinner and I am and there's a moth in my thingy come here you come here I know you're stuck come here yeah go fly away um, it, they're I don't know they're kind of ill-fitting for the top they fit the bottom of the spinner okay um, but they're also making everything kind of slippery I'm just going to throw some paint here just because it's going to fly off. And grab some of this deep blue. And stick on this corner and it'll fly off. And I'm just waiting a second. And it looks like there's something stuck right there. What are you? Hmm. I gotta scoop whatever that is out of there. And I hope it doesn't mess up this painting. There we go. A little clump of something. There we go. All right, looks like it's collected everywhere. Give this a little spin. I love this coming down here. It is gorgeous. So I don't think I want to spin too, too much. Oh my gosh, it's so, so pretty. What are you? That lump is back. Hold on one second, guys. I 
I hate to walk away like that, but I really needed to get some other things to dig out whatever this lump is. You see it? It's like pretty significant. Let's see if I can stab it. Pick it up. I'm not gonna have to drag you off. I'll make another little matching line. They're gone, whatever you were. All right. I just want to spin out this one little corner. Maybe go the other way. Oh my gosh. I hope she likes this. This is gorgeous. Those colors together, really, really spectacular. There's the first one. I'll get you guys down for a close up. Um, at the end, let me turn the camera off and put him away and grab the other canvas. All right, ready for number two. If any of you are interested in uh, a little diptych like this, i um, happy to do commission pieces. Just shoot me an email at uh, waterfallacrylics at gmail.com. Tell me your colors. And uh, we can have a chat. Happy to do it. All right, same order this time. So that worked out really well. So let's go one more with the blue. That olive vine color is to die for, isn't it? It's just so rich and sparkly and there's our gold and I'm going to center this I tend to pour um, puddles closest to me instead of in the middle like the black cell activator and off we go. job with the hair dryer that time this is the part I'm going to kind of leave blank so I'm not going to puff on it I'm just going to give it a second to uh, sew up all by itself patience no no need to rush these stick this over here See it sewing up all by itself. Not that much flew off that time either. I am in love with these colors. All right, let's give it a little spin. try and spin off a little bit of that white if not if it doesn't go it's just so so pretty all right just a little bit I don't like to have a lot of paint on the canvas either yep that's uh that's nicer than the first one I think that is super super pretty that's it uh let me um, put him next to his brother and I'll get you guys down for a close up. Be right back. All right, so here's the uh, close up view of the second one. Uh, really, really quite pleased. The colors in this one, when you see it uh, compared to the first one, are a little more balanced, but the other one has more movement to it, where this one is just uh, very static because I didn't have to do a lot. 
Um, I like the little touches of white. Uh, and that whole middle section is just amazing. It's just, you know, this over here with the uh, green gold around the blue. So, so cool. So there's that one. And then here's this one too. And at first I was worried like, oh, these don't match enough. But they do. This one just looks like it's fanning out here more. and just has more movement. And the edges of this one won't be denied. Because look at that. It's just, that's just too cool for me to uh, redo it and have it look like the other one. So I think, uh, I think I'm keeping those just the way they are. Uh, let me flip around and say goodbye. Hey guys, it's Karen. I'm back with the dried results and I came outside because I wanted to show you the difference um, of these two uh, in the shade or indoor and then what they look like in the sunlight. So here's the first one. They're, they're just really, really gorgeous. Um, I'm going to show you here what it looks like. So these were made with the Color Art Pigments in uh, Payne's Gray, which isn't gray, it's a really lovely shade of dark blue. Uh, olive vine, which is the green, and then some golden iridescent gold on top. There's one, and um, I love the pigments so much, I've become an affiliate. So if you're interested in buying them, you can go to the, the uh, description section and there will be a code, uh, waterfall820, and you can pick some up, 20% off. Here's the second one really really gorgeous so that's what they look like in the shade right now watch um, how they lighten up and get fabulous in the sun so I'm just gonna walk over here by my chair set one down and look at it now they're just amazing y'all love that so there's that was the first one and then here's the second one if I can pick it up keep the camera still and there's the other one Look how the blue um, looks lighter, too. Just. I'm in love. What can I say? That's it for me. I'm not going to show my face. Say goodbye, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video anyway. Take care.